This is a video of some girl crying outside of a Taylor Swift concert. She didn't even go to the concert. She's crying hysterically because Taylor Swift played a, a particular song, singing Exile, also known as a song that saved my life. Um, and her friends, they start kind of like laughing at first, like, oh, <laughs> like, geez, like, calm down. Um, Who's recording this? The friends? Yeah, the, the, someone placed the camera down to record her reaction to it. Uh, someone comments that therapy might be a good choice, which <laughs> I think I agree with. And no, if you guys are watching this show, you know I'm not the big fan of Taylor Swift. Or actually, I'm not a... I think, I think you're I, her biggest fan. What are you talking about? I think I dislike Swifties more than I like Taylor, more than I dislike Taylor Swift because Swifties are the reason that's given Taylor Swift her power. Well, but I that's, was gonna say I think you hate the culture around Taylor Swift, not her. The obsession. Yeah. The obsession and the mid-level music, and she's getting treated like the neck, the the return of Michael Jackson. She's being treated like and like her stuff. If you compare her music to Michael Jackson's music, it's a one compared to the ten. Of Michael Jackson. That's just a, that's a fact. It's not even an opinion. Well, anyways, I, I you want, gotta give her credit to like she directs her music videos. She does a lot. She writes she really, her music. Does she, she got, really? Yeah, I mean, she there's does. so many like select like actors no, no, no. and people out there. She, oh, I direct my stuff, uh, but there's like twelve assistant directors on set well, she, and no. a cinematographer and sixteen producers, and she's kind of just standing there. Well, I kind of like that. Joseph, stuff. I'm saying she's the one. The reason why she's so big like that is because she actually does it all. She actually does. I mean, that's all part of... What are you doing? You gotta talk more into the mic. You want me to talk like this? Don't be a dickhead. But anyways, back to that video. <laughs> um, yeah, I think someone like that should see uh, therapy instead of... I, I, I mean, I don't want to knock on it too much. This is the worst reaction video. Why'd you pull that video up? Because people are talking about it. <sighs> I... Listen, listen. I'll, 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 I'll play devil's advocate with myself. Part of me, the deep internal insides of me, want to, to make fun of that girl. So I'm going to play devil's advocate, and I'm going to be in defense of that girl. Okay. Should I do that? <laughs> okay. Do what you want. So, some people are going through stuff in their lives. Okay. And a lot of people, they, um, they turn to media that helps them get through those things. I get messages all the time. Oh, your videos helped me go through a tough time or whatever. Your prank videos? Yeah, my prank. I don't know how. But You're saying there's a people, nickel on the ground? Yeah. <laughs> that helped people get through some tough times. I've saved lives with those pranks. But uh, I guess people cope in different ways. They use it to take their mind off of things or t take themselves out of the reality of the world that they're living in now to go into a, a different reality to help them get through or sometimes listen to music because it speaks to them and it just makes them feel a type of way and whatever they go through it and then now she's hearing the song live and all those emotions are coming back and they come pouring out passionate joe wow so side i haven't seen that's my devil advocate the other way the, okay. now here we go <laughs> now how i feel grow the fuck up <laughs> like <laughs> so dumb <laughs> all right i guess that's it for this one you have any takes on it? No, that was a terrible reaction, like video to react to. Okay. I mean, I, what do you want me to say? She's crying on the ground. She's recording it. <laughs> yeah, she recorded it. She yeah. set it up and clicked the record button. That's why I asked. Okay. That's why I asked who recorded she that video. She was, in, yeah. was it her friend? Because that made me make it, it her friend. It was definitely bad. her phone. It was definitely her phone. Okay. Because yeah. she titled it like as if it was her. Sydney Tonight, my reaction to Taylor singing Exile, also known as a song that saved my life. A you know what she's hoping? That Taylor, Swe Taylor Swift sees that that night and lets her in. Ah, oh, she's outside. No, she's on stage. She does it all, Gila. Didn't, didn't you forget? She does it all. She, does. she doesn't have the time to look for this You're video because she does right. it all. Okay. But the Swifties will make sure that Taylor Swift sees it. I don't think they will. I think I think Swifties are jealous. I think if she got invited up on stage, I think deep down Swifties would be like fuming because uh. it's not them. Yeah, just yawn another guy. I'm glad that I'm. I'm glad I'm not a Swifty. I am what somewhat a Swifty. Kayla, you were watching the Taylor Swift concert on TV, and you and you were like just smiling the whole time. You're a Swifty <laughs> deep down. Oh yeah, definitely. I fell asleep. You know, it was my, actually a really my good sister. Sleep. It was. A, I think. Shut I'm, up. Okay. No, we're done. I'm. I'm so down okay, to put the Taylor Swift concert on at night because I'll sleep like a freaking baby. That means you really enjoy her music and it's very soothing to your brain. No, it just puts me to sleep <laughs> because it's not something I want to watch. I used to actually. What used to help me sleep in the past? I would put the old Star Trek movies on. 
I remember one night I put it on. I was like, oh, my dad watches this. Let me watch it to like catch up and relate with my dad. So I put one of the old Star Trek movies on. I slept like a baby that night. I fell asleep five minutes in. It was great. And then, I was, then the next day I was like, let me try this again. And I fell asleep again. So throughout high school, I would put the movie on when I would have trouble sleeping because it, it, it was just like to me, to me, it was just so boring. You so amaze put, me. Because if I'm watching a show that I like, like you One Piece, me. for instance, I'm going to like try to keep myself up to watch the show. But if you put something boring on, sleep like a baby. Well, I guess The Walking Dead was not enough to keep you awake last night. We watched like six episodes straight. Care. Okay, that's different. I don't different. care. I was wide awake. I fall asleep every single night and you wouldn't, you just couldn't give me, what, five more minutes? No, I gave, no, you don't understand this. I gave you five more minutes like 20 times in my head. In your head. You didn't communicate that. Because you were going to freak out on me. I did freak out. I said, no, let yeah. me keep watching. Yeah, I let All you right. keep. We're off yeah. track. We're off track. All right.